185 was one of our top Colts. I mean, a book one and possibly the sale. Um, he just kind of had it all. I mean, he, is, he was a star breeze, gallop out, very impressive. The Colt by distorted humor, obviously a, a proven style, you know, stallion that's been around for a long time and has already created a Kentucky Derby winner and funny sides at the breeze show horse went really fast and, and uh, did it the right way. It, it's not just about the time that the horse works in, it's about how they move through the work, how they handle themselves pre-work, and how they finish up after the work. And this was a horse that, that really um, looked the part from start to finish and, and just had a beautiful way of going and sort of poetry in motion uh, with the right pedigree. And then matched it up physically. You know, not only did he go fast, but he's got a two-turn body on him. He's by a very good sire who's also become a good sire of sires out of a grade one dam, uh, good pedigree. So, I mean, he, he kind of had it all. You know, he's coming off a great consigner. They, they do a good job, the Mayberries, prepping their horses and they don't overdo it. So when you see one breeze as fast as he did and golf out as fast as he did, he, he definitely did it on his own. He wasn't pushed to do it. When I went back and reviewed all the times and the, my clocker's notes and everything, he was one that was at the very top of the list to go look at the next day, so I couldn't wait to go see him. And when he matched up on physical, I knew that he was one that we really needed to try to get. Just a, a really handsome, good looking, kind of uh, uh, dominating, sort of powerful type horse with uh, an incredible uh, pedigree, both on the top side and the bottom side. The, the Maris family is very strong. Uh, he's put together the right way. And he's a fast horse that looks like he wants to run all day. Uh, you're talking about a horse that's already proven he can get his offspring to the classics. And we can go to the big races, especially for these horses when they turn three. And, and you're talking about the Triple Crown. And this is the kind of horse that can get you there. He's got a lot of potential to really do anything. I mean, he's, he should be a dirt horse. Um, I think with his breeding and his, uh, his looks and everything like that, he's very fast. Uh, got a great mind. He's got a great pedigree to kind of do anything, and I think he could be any kind of horse. Um, this horse is hopefully one that you'd like to see a good two-year-old year with. Um, and then, you know, if he's good enough, hopefully we could see him as a good three-year-old and, um, you know, have some fun with him in the spring. We knew we had to stretch on him, but I'm really happy that we were able to, to land him. Um, he was a top priority.